again to my channel, of course. So today I decided to do this very beautiful smoky eye, very strong, very dramatic, very black and blue, with pop of blue, it's not everything blue. And I really, really, really love this look. If you want to see all this look being uh, done, just please keep on watching. So guys, I've already primed my eyelids, used uh, Urban Decay Power Primer Potion on my eyelids to prime it. I start by using this bronzer by Kiko Makeup Milano. Um, this is a limited edition and I'm going to put this on my crease. Why I applied now? The eyeshadow it's applied, the brown eyeshadow, um, the bronzer, whatever. Um, uh, I applied on my crease because it's going to help me to blend better the uh, black eyeshadow. To start this look, I'm going to use my uh, Sleek palette and this one is the Bad Girl palette. I'm going to use just this palette to this uh, video. So yeah, I'm just going to tell you right now just on the name of this palette right now for you know what I'm using. And I'm using the Bad Girl uh, 596 palette and I'm going to use this black shade with a little bit of uh, shimmer. And I am going to apply it on my eyelid. Don't worry about the fallouts, I will clean up when I finished uh, everything. same palette of course I'm going to use this black eyeshadow this matte black eyeshadow I'm going to use this on my crease now to blend everything out I'm going to use this big fluffy brush Now I'm going to use this kind of blue purple, maybe it's showing purple on camera, but when once I applied it on top of my black, it's going to look a very uh, it's going to look a very vibrant deep blue. It's very beautiful. I apply it on my eyelid. <laughs> take this white eyeshadow and I'm going to apply it on the center of my eyelids to give more light. I'm going to use again this blue, kind of purplish, whatever, um, on my lower lash line. brush with the same eyeshadow and blend everything out. can see it's pretty pretty messy my under eye area so I think now I'm going to clean up now we'll be finish out the eye later I'll be right back in a second so, as you can see I've already uh, fixed my under eye concealer <laughs> it was a pain in the ass to really really uh, do this very well, you know, but I reshaped a little bit eyeshadow to look more like this side. And let's 
go to the next step to use this eyeshadow right here to I highlight my inner corner and under my eyebrow. <laughs> Now I'm going to use my Kiko Makeup Milano Everlasting Casual to line in black to line my waterline. Now I'm going to use my Kiko Makeup Milano Ultimate Pen uh, Highliner. Yeah. Uh, and I'm going to use this just to do a little thin line on my uh, upper lash line just to have some line to put my falsies on top Now I'm going to apply my mascara on my upper and lower lash lashes and I'm going to put my falsies on top and I will be right back. So guys I've already finished all the makeup on my eyes, applied my lashes, applied my highlighter and all the rest of makeup. So now I'm going to finish my look by applying my lipsticks. I'm going to use all Kiko Makeup Milano lipsticks. Um, this one I don't know really the name because it's, it's vanished from the cap but this one it's kind of a lip gloss and this one it's called a shine lust lip tint and this color it's red it's kind of like this so yeah i'm going to apply this one first <laughs> bit of red just to give more you know dimension in everything so I'm going to use this red lipstick a little bit on top of it this is the finished look look for my lips so guys, this is the final look, of course, as you can see. So yeah, guys, um, hopefully you really liked my dramatic, gothic, deep uh, makeup, very fall look, very vampy, very goth, very everything the way I like, the way I prefer myself, of course, it's my own style. Also, don't forget to thumbs up this video if you really like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to continue to see all these looks being done on my channel. And more and more and more stuff will be come on the future, of course. And also, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram as Vladimir Carpathian, on Facebook as Vladimir Carpathian 2, my self-model page as Vladimir Carpathian 2. <laughs> my Twitter, my Instagram, like I said, Facebook, my blog, my Tumblr, and everything, everything, it's listed down below on the, on the description box below. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video, guys. See you soon on my next video. And yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like I said, a million times. <laughs> so bye-bye.